What three words best describe the learning process? And how can knowing this information improve your curriculum planning and more importantly, influence your teaching? Now to help you catch up in my book, Guide to Memory, I describe how you can bring this schema theory to life. Developing knowledge or a posh word is schema is best described as a mental filing system. So how we organize information in code describes this process, how we might process new information. Storage identifies how we organize the information and manipulate it. And retrieve is where we recall the information and use it in a future scenario. So encode, store, retrieve best describes the learning process. And by revisiting material in the retrieval process, we consolidate or build on what we know and strengthen our schema further. Now there's a lot more to it, but this is a good beginner's guide. I like to think about developing knowledge as a spider web. Now, if you think of a spider, what happens at the start when they start to spin a web? And what happens to the spider web when it's broken or even if it's established, what needs to be repaired or enlarged or strengthened during that spider web's lifespan? The more the information is organized, the more easier it is to build that knowledge further and then start to use this in unfamiliar situations. So that word again, for me, metacognition keeps popping up time and time again. Still quite an abstract concept. What does this look like in practice? I'll help in future videos. But my question for teachers is, how does your current curriculum planning process support the encode, store, retrieve cycle? Thanks for watching.